Hello world, welcome back to Celebrate 23, let's play The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. Uh, we are in Novigrad, trying to find things to do. I need to just talk to the supervisor. Don't like folk wandering around here. Oh yeah? Well, got a beast you need someone to get rid of? I'm here about the notice. Uh, supervisor Lund posted it. Yeah, a beast haunts the outskirts, murdering folk. Got them scared to leave their homes after dusk. I aim to hunt down this monster. Best hurry, then some other bloke's already after it. Who took the contract? Didn't see the man. He was just told some brave fool turned up. Any eyewitnesses to these attacks? No, just the body. Beast appears only at night. Chooses isolated victims. When do you find the last victim? Just last night. Hubert, a beggar, but a decent man. I'd let him sleep in his shed from time to time. That one on the right. Eustace hasn't come for the corpse yet. It's lying in there where I found him. Thanks. So long. of a Garcane or a Flutter. Gotta be an Ekimara. I haven't seen a broken rake in a while. strength was sneaking along the shoreline. No use doing any work in this rain. Tracks and deer. Ought to look for prints on the other side. Not a drop of blood left in him. Gotta be an Ekimara.
Greetings, Lambert. Damn, it's good to see you, Wolf. Decide to do some hunting in Novigrad? For as I remember, you never liked this city. Still don't. Thing is, I got a certain matter to take care of. What have you been up to? Any luck on the path? A lot, in fact. Quite the takings in Lan Exeter. Was asked to hunt down a giant who turned out to be a forest troll and some bandits. Bandits? Came as a package with the troll. The matter you mentioned. Anything I can help with? Hmm. Maybe. But we'll talk about that later. Got a reward to collect. I'm kinda in a hurry. Let's say you've earned half. What the hell? Join you for that later. Wait up for me. Fine, but try not to take too long. Know where the supervisor has his office? Yeah, had a chat with a guardsman outside it. See you there. Well, that was annoying, and my battery just died. The thing is, I literally just checked it a few minutes ago, and it said it was fine. I got way too much stuff. Let's collect our reward. So? What do you think? We did what we had to do. Time to pay up. Wait here, I'll go see the supervisor, get your reward. Do that ourselves. No reason you should abandon your post. Hmm. Hmm. Can't argue with reason. Go on in. We dealt with the monster at the docks, here for our reward. Witches? Since when do you travel in pairs? A lot of dangers lie in wait for a lone witcher. Bandits, for example. I advise you to change your tone. Where's Yad Keridin? Talk. Lambert, calm down. Trust me, Geralt, this is important. There's something I gotta know. I do not know any Keridin. Take your coin for the before and bugger off, before I lose my temper. Where's Yad Keridin? Asking you for the last time. Guards, to the dungeon with them. Yeah! <laughs> 
This guy's more trouble than the Yakimara. The Karadins disappeared. I swear. The others too. Uh, I only know of Vienne. What about Vienne? She drinks at the Seven Cats. They're day and night. See? You can be helpful. You crazy? What the hell are you doing? I can explain everything. More guardsmen will show soon. Let's go. Meet me at the Seven Cats. Tell you everything there. The Tavern VN frequents? Yeah, see you later. Alright, so this place is somewhere I wanted to go anyways. Cool. Mugs. Need your help in a grave matter. What's this grave matter? I came here on business. Sadly, just there across the river. Toward the bridge's end, I was attacked. Smashed a bottle of the finest dwarven spirit on the bugger's skull. But the robbery was still a partial success. Tell me what you want already, and be brief. Thief ran off with my documents. Very important documents. I need you to get it back for me. It'll cost you. I don't work for free. That I know. Since the dawn of time, no witcher's lifted a finger without pay. I've a smatter in a coin in the soles of my boots. The thunder <coughs> and it's yours. Fine. See what I can do. My last chance. I'm out of ideas if this don't work. Suspicious to me, trap. Dwarven moonshine. Nothing stinks quite like it. There's the bottle. Muggs was attacked here. They ought to never let your kind in, Novigrad proper.
hand over the documents, thief. Me? A thief? I won him straight, I did, in a game of cards. Not how Mug sees it. Claims he was... mugged. He lost, demanded them papers back, and when I refused, he walloped me over the noggin with a bottle. Barely escaped with me life. How much are they worth to you? I don't read myself, but I've seen the seals. I know it ain't no scrap of arsewipe. I won't sell them to the first fella comes asking. Give me the papers. You have to. True. Definite. time you explain some things. Why'd you kill Lund? What's this all about? Want the short version or the long? Let me hear the whole thing. I had a friend. Aiden was his name. You had a friend? Oh, you're fucking hilarious. I met him soon after I'd accepted a contract to lift the curse from the Ogre of Elander. Aiden had been hired to kill him. He was a witcher from the school of the cat. Far as I remember, the ogre was killed in the end. Yeah. After it gutted my employer, we really didn't have a choice. I cut a deal with Aiden. We joined forces, split the reward for killing the ogre between us. After that, we worked together a lot. Hands down the best man I'd ever met. I mean, I like you, you know that. Still. No comparison. What happened to him? Some time ago, Aiden took on a contract to lift a curse off a Duke's daughter. It was a political mess from the start. Then there was hatred for the school of the cat to deal with. They worked hard to deserve that hate. Basically turned hired assassins. Aiden wasn't like that. Anyway, some of the Duke's courtiers had designs, weren't at all keen on the curse being lifted from the Duke's firstborn. So a band of trained assassins ambushed Aiden, murdered him. Our dear supervisor was one of them. And he had Keridin? The assassin's leader, and the one to deal the mortal blow. Sorry about your friend. Don't need your sympathy, just your help. We have to talk to Vien. Must have had enough to drink by now, let's go. What do you want? We want to see Yad Keridin. <laughs> now why would I help you? It's really important to my friend here. And what will I get out of it? Pay for your beer, for starters. Then we'll see how valuable your information is. I was part of Caradin's band, but when was that? I don't know where to find him. I've fallen out with a lot. Besides, he's no longer chummy with his old mates. The word around town is he's changed. Caradin's changed? What do you mean? He's dropped all his old connections. Stopped taking on petty killings. He's hidden himself away in some hole. Must be planning something big. Who else was in Keridan's band? Aside from me, Sleaze, Hammond, and Lund. But they've scattered all over the world. Sleaze went to Tresicore, Hammond to Skellige, and Lund. Lund's dead. <laughs> 
<laughs> Finally met his match. Well, you've only Hammond or Sleeves to talk to you then. What about you? What's your story? Scoyatel. Unit was decimated, so I joined Caradin. They never treated me as an equal. No. I could hit a sparrow from a hundred paces. But I was never good enough for Caradin. He always preferred that cancelese. You have a hand in the murder of the Witcher, Aiden? Perhaps. I don't remember. We need information about Hammond. Caradin's right-hand man once. When the band broke up, he went back to Pharaoh once he had come. He's a pirate now. Even the Arles treat him with respect. This Salise. Where can we find her? She's done well for herself. Runs a brothel in Tresigal, the kind rich men frequent. Pours suck information out of them. Then she sells it. Name of this brothel? The Black Lily. Celise always did have horrible taste. <coughs> Satisfied? She doesn't know anything. We need to talk to Hammond and Celise. Don't go looking for Karazin. If he senses you nipping at his heels, he'll kill you without batting an eye. We'll see. As for you... No, Lambert. Right. Better to leave her like this. What about my coin? Arseholes. <laughs> you gotta help me, Geralt. Best thing will be to split up. You sail to Skellige. Try to squeeze something out of Hammond. I'll go to Tredegor and meet with Salise. Lambert, let's talk about this. No, let's not. This is one of those situations, serious situations, when you don't ask unnecessary questions and just help your friend. Where will we meet once I'm back? At the Nowhere Inn. All right, I'm off. Good luck. I found the thief who took your documents. I can't be. Let's go get him. You could hold him while I take what's mine. Slow down. See, this man said he never attacked you. Said you lost to him at cards. Ah, cheeky bastard. But like me Aunt Rosalie always say, lies got but wee legs and don't run far. The documents belong to my employer. A deed to a townhouse in Wengerberg. And true enough, I've been drinking, got a bit carried away, and I lost them in the game of cards. Then you whacked the winner on the head with a bottle. W w what was it to do? I he weren't willing to give him back. When the scoundrel drew a weapon, I, I fled. But without them papers, I haven't the gumption to show my face at home. Here, now pay up. Of course I will. Give you all I've left. We'd not have it any other way.
Okay. That's a soft view. Now I need to go where? How do I get the Skellige? I suppose I've got a Skellige. First, go to Foro. Faro? Now what? Is it a different person or is it the same person? heal already on god i say victory will be mine this time i've practiced with shield and sword many a headless scarecrow around here heed my warning and stand and fight duly heeded now show me what you got not your lucky day <laughs> Yes, but next time... Go back to Mate Bilberry and apologize for being an ass. Quick, before I change my mind and break your bones. We shall meet again! Bunch of shopkeepers. Seems every time you turn around, there's more scouting going on. If you used to allow me, it was stock in all Novigrad. No need to push, enough for all comers. Ah, uh, no one to push. Very good. Manners before trade, always. Let me have a look.
find a way to Skellige. Right, let's just check, see what level this Okay, yeah, it's it's my level range, so let's go. the other quest. What's it to you? I'm Skelliger bound. Need to get there. Start swimming. Islanders, the black ones, all attackers in those waters. No one sails the route these days. Come on. Clans are ready to deal. Leave you alone if you do. Someone's done it. Gotta have. Not likely. Except maybe that daft bastard Wolverstone from the Atropos. A liar, a thief, and a bugger, that one. He might have parlayed with the sea swine. Hmm. Where can I find him? In a pigsty most times. Others, the golden sturgeon. Ask for Flask. Everyone knows him. Oh. Ah. <laughs> I need to go to the golden sturge for another reason, anyways. Look at that. That was awesome. Some fellas out, Master. We're a bit of coin short when I've around. Cause we're comrades, see? Witcher, ain't you? We're butchers. You slaughter, we slaughter. Except witchers earn more. Old villagers pitch in. <coughs> Lords open their purses. Ladies do like with their legs. Guess I've been to the wrong villages. Dealt with the wrong lords and ladies. Come, don't make us beg. What's the witcher for, anyways? To help men in need. You boys look tired. Probably ought to go home now. Well, how long we've been drinking now? Two days. Well said, Master. A home we will go. Burgers and 
Jesus of the free city. That would be me. Has the honor to see the seas are tossing, yeah. tossing, <laughs> and the wind keeps blowing and blowing. to sounds like this before, let alone participated. I will guide you. We must first achieve a kind of mental accord. I must ask some questions. You must answer them. It's important you're truthful. Answer from your heart. Let's begin. To start with, tell me a memory you have of this woman. What for? Do as I ask, please. I need the strongest, most complete memory you have of... Siri. The woman's name is Siri. It was after her time training at Kaer Morhen. After the moment when Yennefer first called Siri her daughter. We'd been separated. I knew she was in danger. I dreamt of her multiple times. I found her at Stiga Castle. She'd gone there to free Yen and gotten herself captured in the process. They wanted to hurt her. I remember fighting side by side with Ciri on stairs slippery from blood. It was the first time she ever deflected a crossbow bolt with her sword. Told her never to try it again. These memories, they're intense. Do you wish to continue? I have more to say. Then please do. It was in Rivia. The second war with Nilfgaard had just ended. There was still tension in the air. For gods know what reason race riots erupted in the town. I tried to do something, but... Couldn't stop a riled crowd. A boy with a pitchfork. He ran it right through my gut. Jennifer lay dying as well. Siri had us carried onto a boat. We sailed to a place where apple trees bloom eternal. She left us there. That was the last time I saw her. Is there anything you'd like to add? Another memory, perhaps? Yes, there's something else. All right. Tell me no more than you wish to. I accepted a job once. Did it. Asked to choose my reward, I invoked the Law of Surprise. Never thought I'd actually meet the child promised to me at that time. Years later, I was in the Broccolon Forest. Happened on a girl there. Didn't know who she was. The Dryads wanted to keep her, turn her into one of their own. But the Waters of Oblivion? They failed in her case. Siri came out of Broccolon with me. I sent her back to her grandmother then, but already I felt bound to her. By destiny. By something more. Thank you. Would you be willing to share another memory? Yes. No need to rush. We have time. Ciri was orphaned during the second war with Nilfgaard. I had no idea what to do with a young girl, so I did what I would have done with a boy. And took her to care more in. Figured some physical training, sword work, development of her stamina couldn't hurt. I remember her standing on a crumbling wall. A stone came loose, she lost her footing, caught her at the last possible instant. Strongest memory, though, is of her coming out of her room one day. 
wearing a dress and claiming she was indisposed. Knew then that Siri was maturing. It was unavoidable. I was lost in the face of that. You claim the woman has abilities. Tell me about them. She's a child of the Elder Blood. A descendant of Bloody Falker? The rebel burned at the stake. The prophecies claim the world's destroyer will be born of the Firebrand's cursed blood. Pure legend. No one a legend transforms into prophecy. When it gains believers. I think you're right to be reticent in talking about the woman. I see. Do you wish to say more? Yeah. There's something else. They call Ciri the Lady of Space and Time. Once I asked Jennifer why, she... travels between worlds. <laughs> Turns out I don't know how to talk about it. Didn't really understand much of what Yen told me. I just know there's more to it than traveling to different places, and that Ciri carries immense power in her blood. I see. Do you wish to say more? Yeah, there's something else. I remember Siri having trouble controlling her abilities. Yennefer tried to teach her to cast simple spells, and Siri destroyed a shed near the temple where they were. Really upset her, but it was just an old shed. I know it took her a while to gain control, and frankly, I doubt she controls her abilities fully to this day. I see. Do you wish to say more? No. Can we start? Naturally. I knew you cared about her. But your tone, the emotions you so carefully conceal. Let's continue, please. Make yourself comfortable and try to relax. You must take my hand and talk of Siri. Tell me where you think she might be. Who could be at her side? <laughs> if Siri couldn't find me, I'm sure she would have looked for another friend. Who do you mean? Yennefer wasn't in Novigrad. Triss was. But Ciri never found her. Maybe Dandelion? They liked each other a lot. the dreams can multiply. Show the past as well as the future. The swallow. It symbolizes Ciri. She contacted Dandelion. I didn't know he was in town. The poet? Heard about him? Someone left him the rosemary and thyme in their will. The rosemary and thyme? Where's that? As you enter the city through the red light district, you come upon a bridge. The rosemary is just past it. Dandelion inherited a brothel? So I've heard. Thanks for your help. Good luck, Witcher. I hope you find your Siri.
Wolverston, captain of the Atropos. So you wanna know if I'm Atropos, captain of the Wolverston? No fucking clue, mate. I need to get to Skellige. My Atropos and me. We're due to sail for odds. Carrying grain. But that's our shush. Got any coin? Bowls. When do we sail? Not sure you're ready. You can barely stand. Know this, stranger. Captain Wolverston never sails sober. The sea goes one way, Wolverston the other. Makes the rock unbearable. So, ready to set sail? Let's go. Uh, first, we must drink to, to good fortune and to the strength of my Atropos. Anchors away! point start, start the next uh, episode here or on the other end of this hopefully <coughs> assuming this happens uh, without any real fighting or anything we'll see what happens
Fear the dying. See, I've landed on Ord Skellig. How you figure that? You're wearing clan on crate colors. Ord Skellig's their island. On the Atropos, were you? Yeah. Thought the captain had a deal with you. With us? Meaning who exactly? Might have arranged something with Lugos, but crack? Nay. Clearly should have, though. Outlander ships aren't welcome in these waters. What about you? What do you seek in Skellige, eh? Agreed to meet a sorceress here. Yennefer of Vengerberg. She's supposed to be on Ord Skellig. There's a wetcha Kertrolda. Croc's guest. Could be the one you're meeting. That scorn I hear in your voice. You've good ears. Folks say this witch got Croc wrapped around her finger. Orders everyone about. Word is she's vicious at it, but a hag's a hag. Seen her? Know what the sorceress looks like? Aye. Where's black and white? If not for her tits, you'd think she was a beached orca. Fact is, even those who see her for a wench would gladly push her out to sea, tits and all. Even those who see her for a wench should gladly push her out to sea, tits and all. Okay. Jennifer's not all bad, once you get to know her. <laughs> Take your word for it. Know the way to Kertrolda? I expect I'll find it. Head north. Then turn west towards the bay before you come to the bridge. You'll find the Jarl port site today. Your sorceress ought to be there too. Thanks. So long. is here somehow. not have enough of those yet.
place of power should draw from it. I did say that a few minutes ago. 